Hi everyone. So uh, the painting today, uh, I'm using my leftovers from my last painting. Uh, if you watch my last video, you will have noticed that I um, had extra paint. I didn't put all of my paint in the the glass. Uh, I didn't use the fluorescent colors uh, and. Uh, I'm going to use those paints today and uh, what I'm going to do is uh, just the cling film, no color on the cling film. So I'm really curious to see what that will look like and I think it will look very good. So let's get started on this. Uh, I will put the colors I've used in the description but uh, I have the phthalo blue Naphthal Red Light. This is Cadmium Red Hue, but the pigment in it is the same pigment as that is in uh, Hansa Yellow Light. So it's very light density. This is the Iridescent Pearl, Fluorescent Green, Fluorescent Blue, and Quinacridone Violet. I also have uh, my cheek <laughs> sheet here, <laughs> so I know in which order to put them, because uh, I take notes and everything, some I remember, and uh, sometimes I get mixed up. Uh, the densities, uh, there's a lot of different colors, so it's kind of hard to remember, so I have to go back to my notes uh, to look and make sure. Mm, and this time I have written them down, so I put them in the right order. So yeah, let's get started on this. I will zoom you in so you can see um, be putting the paints in the cup and then the flip cup. So I'm going to start with the iridescent pearl. It's the most dense. Then the phthalo blue. Same as last time, we'll use the side of the cup so the paint stays on top. And I have some stages. After the phthalo blue, it's the quinacridone violet. After that, it's the naphtha red light. So I mixed my paint the usual way, paint, water and medium. Um, for the high flow acrylics I use 110 as a ratio, one part pan, uh, paint and 10 part medium. And for the rest I use 50-50 paint medium and I add water up to 25%. After the red, oh right, it's the fluorescent. I'm going to start with the blue. Then the green. And now we flip. There's a huge bubble in it. Okay. 
Too bad I can't leave that this way because this is too much paint and it won't dry right. But damn it looks nice that way. I love it. And now to tilt. Here comes the clean film. That's interesting. You get all the pearl paint getting out, but I like this side a lot. I think it would be better if I just dipped it and not swipe it like I did. I did swipe a little bit here and it's not super, but cells are coming through. And bubbles too. I have to pop those. So I'll give you a time lapse so you can see the painting change. And the cells appear if I think they will keep appearing. So yeah, it'll be interesting. I've got an idea guys I am going because I think uh, there's a bit of a lack of details some cells are popping up but just not as much as I would like uh, I didn't expect or made that painting for cells but um, the bottom here uh, lacks a bit of details to my liking so I thought I would take the back end of the brush and just Play with the paint. I quite like it. It looks nice. Adds just a little bit of something. And we're back! Uh, so, I have to say, uh, I quite like the, all the top part. It's the top part where I only actually dipped the thing, uh, the clean film thing. Yeah. <laughs> And the bottom part, well, it lacked a bit of details to my liking, but I think just a little spirals add a little something. Uh, it's not a lot, but it's just enough for me. And I made them start from the line that occurred the, with the swipe motion. And I'll know for next time, I'll just dip. Uh, I'll just dip this uh, clean film in it, so I get this on the whole canvas. Uh, maybe if I would have swiped with a color on it, it would have made more cells, more details, but I had nothing on the uh, clean film, so uh, some little cells appeared where there was uh, some of their distant pearl, 
but that's about it. Not that all that much. A little here too. It's kind of cute. <laughs> Some baby cells. <laughs> uh, the colors though, the colors are really nice and I love the, that corner here with the pearl blue, green and purple, the, the well, violet. Um, and I love how it goes to yellow, um, the grades. Um, yep, I like it. I, I really do actually. It's uh, very different from what I do. Uh, usually, it doesn't look at all like one of my paintings, except the fluorescent colors. Uh, I can't wait to put it under black light and see what it looks like. But I'll have to wait for it to dry. Um, you are lucky, because you'll get to see it at the end of the video. Um, and yeah, that's about it. On that note, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day. Um, make sure to subscribe for more and I will see you in the next video. Bye!